Hey, I'm going to test the auto cancel feature of Blur Bidding. This feature helps you not to buy NFTs if the other bidders who were bidding higher than you cancel their offers or if their bids are accepted. So it actually adds another layer of protection. So what we are going to do is actually we are going to follow these steps. We are going to test this from two accounts. In the first step, we are going to place the highest bid on NFT in its lifetime collection. Right now, the highest bid is, let's check it, uh, 0.17. We are going to place something like 0.18. Then we are going to start submitting our bids from the second account and we are going to underbid by 0.01. So what we are doing here is actually we are going to be positioning ourselves as the second highest offer. Then we are going to cancel the first bid we made, which was from the first account, and we refer it as account X. And then we will expect the system to auto-cancel the previously sent bids of account Y, which is the second account, in order to protect itself from your bids to get accepted. Uh, it might sound a little bit complicated, but right now you will see that it's not actually that complicated in action. So let's go ahead and place one bit on this collection. So here, place collection bit. Right now the top bit is 0.17. I'm going to place 0.18 with size of 1. Let's, let's place it. All right, so now the bid is placed. So if we go to portfolio and bids, we see that uh, this is our bid amount. And if we go to the collection right now, the top bid is 0 0.18. Right now, we are going to uh, submit our auto bids from the system. And we will expect it to be placing bids of 0 0.17. My max is 0.2, my default bit is 0.01. We are expecting to see 0.17 because the system is going to underbeat the value by 0.01 and it is under my max bit. So let's submit it. And, and let's go. In meanwhile, I will go to Blur here and also check my bits. As you see right now, there is no active bits. Yeah, now the first one is sent. Let's uh yeah here yeah, here you see it so the auto cancel is on right so right now if i go to the other one and cancel that bit i will expect this one to be cancelled as well so let's just check this one yeah it is still here so i'm going to cancel my bit here uh let's go to bits this one cancel bit all right this bit is cancelled now I'm expecting this one to go away and the new bit is going to be 0.16, I believe. Since then, the since my highest bit is gone, the bit price is going to go down to 0.17. So let's check. <coughs> As you see, the previous bit is cancelled and the new bit is 0.16 because now the uh, highest bit is 0.17. So just keep in mind that this cancelling process is done one by one. So if you have uh, like 30 previous bits, it's going to take some time to cancel them because there is no function of cancelling them all. However, as you see, it, this is tremendously helpful. Uh, all right, guys. Happy flips, happy trades, happy point farming.